into the overcast night, stepped without sight and heard the chorus of crickets breathing gently, toads prostrate near the pond quieting, a red squirrel's yammer before bedding, and saw the first star appear between sauntering clouds as the tops of trees swaying gently before the coming wind silhouette the sky, the day settled. Slow march beneath the blanket hung under the expanse clipped by the knoll ahead the forest's edge at the apple tree, where the raspberries braid upon each other, and the grass abandoned to being sighs. The overcast night, alone yet unafraid, less for the moment unnoticed or lost, warms as the sun cannot and won't, until it's risen again in the twilight dawn.